okay guys now let's uh, continue with the software part of this msp430 evaluation kit now you can see that uh, this is the basic msp430 board with this 40 header pins this can be seen you can see actually this is the 3.3 volts pin and alongside is the 5 volt this is ground and all continues all you can actually get everything in the website of ti and you can easily find out all the design files software and hardware files also now i just want to uh, show you the examples of this mc430 so that you can get a better insight of this type of boards now you can actually plug in with this micro b port usb port you can see it has put it up and i will show you the hid feature of this device first of all let's do with the uh, simple led blinking so we need to open the now let's uh, come to the programming part of this device we will see the uh, simple blinking example and the hid feature of this device now this device can actually be programmed with uh, two type of uh, ides which are available in the internet energia ide and uh, uh, CCS that is Coast Composer Studio version 8 which is available. Uh, one more ID is also available for professionals that is called that is called IAR. Now we will continue with the beginners for better understanding. Uh, we will use the Energia ID um, and uh, you can see this is the Energia ID's interface and it is very much uh, like Arduino. So users who are actually using Arduino can actually easily shift to is energy IDs. This ID does not have that much com compatibility as Arduino, but it is good. So we must uh, go to the examples, and you can see for basics, we will get a bling example, and we just have to select the tools and the select the board port, and this is MSP EXP 430 F5529 LP. LP stands for launch pad. So click on that, then again go to the tools. You just must go to the port and it has got COM24 and 25 and users may have the confusion which to choose so the better option is to go to the device manager and you will see under the ports MSP application UART for COM25 and MSP debug interface COM24. So it's better to choose the UART application. Debug is for advanced users. It is best, it is better to use this UART one. So it is COM25. The confusion is cleared. So just click on tools and then port and COM25. Okay, selected. You can see this is the basic code of this uh, energy ID. And uh, I must say what in MSP430, you can see this one is the LED1, this one is the LED2. So these are and two, idea, two LEDs and two user programmable buttons. So just click on the upload button and it will upload. It will take some time to upload. So once it is uploaded, Once it is uploaded, you can see during uploading it is actually showing that and once you upload it you can see the blink example. Very small blinking example you can see it is blinking. Okay, thank you guys for watching this video and for more videos follow angle bracket and do not forget to subscribe, share, like, comment and do not forget to press that bell icon. Thank you very much.